弁でお願いいたします。ご協力お願いいたします。So far, giant lines. To do what? Who knows? That's the lollipop store if you want a lollipop. Wow. So let's just stand in line all day to get a lollipop then. Sounds good. Today, we are in Kawasaki. There's an Alex. And we're here for what? Kanemaru? Yeah, we're here for Kanemaru Matsuri, the world famous penis festival. Let's see if we can get in a line to somewhere. There's a lot of lines and they go really far and I don't care about them. Let's see some penises. We're gonna see some penises. Not safe for work and also children. <laughs> and for life. <laughs> just don't watch this. <laughs> go away. Please help yourself. We just went to a grocery store and Mike is gonna try this immediately because he can't wait. It looks so good. He cannot wait. It does not. It looks like my favorite thing. It looks like carbs wrapped in carbs. Which perfect. Wow. I feel like we should be drunk before eating that. I know. It seems that That's what I bought it for, but Oh, is it delicious? It's definitely noodles and bread. It's so bad. Bread. Like, why? It's perfect. It's, it's just perfect. a huge party. Thoughts? Noodles inside of bread. Yep. 100% <laughs> what that is and what it tastes like. Oh, this is wonderful. I got a Tokyo Black for it and it's great. So that's all that really matters. Your noodle bread is weird. This is my drink of the evening because I don't like beer and some for some reason they want me wasted. Hi friends, here's my here's here's, here's my experience update. with the penis festival. So far, my eyelash falling off because my eye likes to water like nobody's business. Yeah. Um, also, drunk. Just much of a thing. Yeah. Also, um, the scene maybe like not one penis. <laughs> Which is we're waiting for the penis to move just once. It's not happening. We've been here since 10:30. It's noonish. I got my picture taken. You did. <laughs> You're so fancy. And there's just like this, <laughs> there's just this like tiny square. See, see hands. That's the ti like tiny size. square. Uh, and there's two penises in there, and there's a little <laughs> temple back here, and that's the whole area. That's the whole thing. We think. We don't know. Yeah, I, who, could <laughs> know? who could know? Where is it? No, I don't know. Large, we, we thought that it was gonna be like this whole town was just like penises, and everyone's like, yeah, because all of the you know the pictures and stuff. Shops. But there was like people in costumes. Stuff. Yeah. Where's the costume? There's like a three lines. No probably to get the like three goods that you could get at the penis festival and then <laughs> and then we're all just awkwardly standing around drinking, drinking beer things from a <laughs> drinking beer from a supermarket cuz we couldn't find don't better places better, to do it we don't know better <laughs> so that's penis Even festival day the supermarket, I'm like <laughs> oh, who knows dollars <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yeah, I'll update you if there, anything oh, more here. penis related happens. Also, I, I that bought these <laughs> and I think they're sembe, but I don't know for sure. And we're thinking maybe they're not food. <laughs> but no. I ate two of them, so hopefully they're We all okay. ate some, so hopefully they're food. <laughs> they're gonna be alright. <laughs> there are children around. Yes, a lot. A lot of children yeah. for, a, for a festival of this variety. There was a bachelorette cool. party. There was, and they yeah, were through. And they were just like, so here we are. Wow. Woo. Woo. I was told there would be penises. Question mark. Call. Always follow the people with no pants. We're getting up. Take your bag of goodies. Bag of goodies. No pants, men. It's time. It's time. This is gonna be just the most special vlog. Here, film it. I'm too short. Oh. I can't really see anything.
as we walk to uh, the festival area again, uh, Alex, would you like to tell the story of the sure. penises? So there, there's three penises that get walked, basically, and one of them, the supposedly the original uh, shrine god, basically, which is what they're walking around, is mm -hmm. a, a little, sort of this big size metal dildo. Uh -huh. And supposedly the story goes that a lady, her vagina was possessed by a demon, so it had teeth, and it bit off her husband's penis twice. <laughs> Don't know how. Oh man. <laughs> Two times. Imagine that, Mike. Not fun. Just right? grew it back and just so she the went to the shrine, time, and... and they made her a big metal dildo, and then she put it in, and the demon tried to bite it off, and it broke its teeth on the metal dildo. <laughs> metal, of course. And so. The demon left and she was able to have sex with her husband again and that's part of the shrine god now, that metal, big metal dildo. But that's the story behind it, that's one story. The big pink one is called Elizabeth and it was donated by a, um, like a drag queen club hmm. and so it's been part of the festival ever since then. That's beautiful. Yeah, isn't that special? And the third one, I don't know if there's a story behind it, but yeah, the big dildo. It's just, you know, penis, just you know? penises. Celebrating penises. So those are the penises, so the penis We cut the penis festival short, and now we are in Megro. Yeah. And it's, uh, it could be prettier, I guess. still. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're so negative. I know. Yeah. Could be but prettier. But it's nice. <laughs> yeah. This would be quite pretty in a few days. Yes. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Such arts. Uh, confident colors. Time. Good talk. <laughs> Are we not going in there? It seems like it seems like food. <laughs> They're so yeah. amazing. We, we decided that they were our favorite girl group. Yeah. It's important. We definitely saw them perform. Yep. We've known about them for longer than today. <laughs> a really long time. And they asked us to watch their performance and we did. We so did it. We did it. Yeah. And I love them. Also, if you didn't notice, the lashes have come off. <laughs> They're gone. Done. <laughs> the last thing that I told you guys so we're just gonna do a little story time and start from the beginning again I'm all like showered and ready for bed no makeup but this is what happened today we decided that we we're going to go to Kanamata Matsuri which is the penis festival um, basically um, the town of the district I guess of Kawasaki I believe um, has a fertility god that they have a shrine to so every year on the first Sunday of April they throw a festival for that god um, but it has since devolved into something kind of crazy where there are penis candies and people in like penis outfits and there were like crossing guards, um, cross dressing in cosplay, cross play, and uh, 
it always looked so crazy in the pictures that I've seen of it and the videos that I've seen of it. Like, oh man, look at all of this cool stuff happening. But it's just this packed in little square of activities and then the rest of the town is dead because everyone's trying to get into the festival. It was very anticlimactic so we decided to uh, take the train back into Tokyo and we went to Meguro River which is a cute little river lined with cherry blossom trees and it was very pretty except for the fact that a lot of the cherry blossoms have still not opened um, but we walked around took some pictures and we found another festival going on which was just a little sakura festival which was a lot nicer because it was not crowded with a million tourists just like street vendors local businesses stuff like that so we got some takoyaki and some beer and just hung out there for a little bit. I don't remember the name of the ramen place that we went to. I'm gonna put the title on the screen now because I took pictures of it. Um, but it's apparently one of the best ramen places in Tokyo. Kind of one of those like small restaurants with not very many seats and a giant line outside because people love it. And it was like, you know, we, we they get your order while you're still standing outside and it's just like in and out. Um, and then we went and got some 7-Eleven goodies and I ate some ice cream in the bath because I'm classy like that. And now I am ready for bed and it's super duper early but everyone's tired and that's that. Tomorrow is Harajuku, which is super exciting. Yeah, I'm super excited. I don't know how I'm ending these vlogs. The end.